hello friends today in this tutorial i will be showing you a project that i developed right here it's in a transition mode right here so basically we have developed a omegle clone inside our next js application so it's just a replica of the original omegle.com websites where you basically interact with the strangers and around the world so i built my own omegle inside next year so this is basically look like this if you are watching it this is the application guys if you are watching it so we have the text version right here if you basically click the text version guys it will now look for someone to chat with so i have opened the two windows side by side you can now see the second window is also open here and now if i basically click on text so now these two persons will be connected right here so if you just you can see you are now chatting with a random developer and uh, now we have this field out there so i will say hi so this message you will see the color scheme is similar to omegle your will be in blue color and the devil stranger will be in red color you will see that so i can exchange messages guys you can see that how you see it is so all these messages you can exchange so basically it's looking at uh, the look and feel is very much omegle like we also offered the dark theme as well if you want the dark theme you can even switch to dark theme as well so we are basically using here mongodb at last we are also using prisma and we also using chakra ui library so all these technologies we are using here so next chairs as you all know it's a react chair server side full stack framework so we are using this framework and also we are using chakra ui so this is basically a simple modular and accessible content ui library we are also using prisma which is basically a uh, library for basically defining your schema it works with all the popular databases such as mysql specifically in this we are using node oh sorry mongodb so these are some of the technologies and also we are using for real time communication we are not using socket.io we are using pusher js so pusher js guys it's a website which similar to socket.io but it's a paid one you need to create account here and it it is similar to socket.io and it gives you notifications whenever some events take place inside your application so these events are let's suppose you once a application connect so whenever user clicks the text button and here also click the text button so when they are available they are automatically joined here you will see that the logic is doing there and it is now signifying that one person is online and automatically both these persons are now connecting so they can be exchanging messages here from one another so similar to omegle random matching take place and let's suppose four persons are there they can be matched with one other so we would be uh, i have provided the full source code guys if you want to uh, basically build on top of what i am building right here you can directly uh, access the source code i have given the link in the description of the video you can basically after you do this you will get this directory structure and uh, this directory structure basically this package.json we have using chakra ui library we are using you can see prisma we are using axios as well we are using pusher library react and framer motion so all these libraries we are using here guys so first of all in dot env you need to basically mention your database url so i am using mongodb database url which is a production mongodb compass you can need to provide the url of your database and then inside this you will need to sign up on pusher dot com and there you will get your app id pusher key next pusher key secret key all that stuff you need to replace here and then you need to start this application simply type npm run dev this will start your dev server on the local host you will see that so basically we have used uh, typescript for building this application guys you will see that how easy it is to build a omegan clone so we have not tackled the video chatting application yet but if you have time you can tackle with your own self 
we are having this dark light version as well if you prefer the dark one you will prefer so the link is given guys in the description of the video if you want interested you can check out the source code the link is given and I think it's a very good beginning if you want to develop Omega clone and Prisma as I talked about Prisma interacts with every database it's basically generator client library and here provider it can take MySQL, PostgreSQL, uh, SQLite, MongoDB so environment variable it is taking this value which is here defined right here and then we need to generate the migrations which will basically generate the table inside this database so if you don't know about uh, Prisma then it will be new for you so these are the three components this is a chatting component we are, we are exchanging messages and this is a header component this is an intro component so so we can see that so basically guys if you are interested the link is given in the description and i will be seeing you in the next video